Hi planners, thanks so much for tuning in to my YouTube channel. It's me, Chloe from Chloe Tree Plans. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and scroll down and hit that little red button in the bottom right corner to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you are a true blue subscriber, welcome back. Today, I'm going to be showing you the Back to School Collection by Erin Condren for 2021. I'm really excited about this because as most of you know, I do work in education and so back to school is always a special time for me. So in looking at these products, I can see how they can be used and I'm really excited about sharing them with you. These products are brand new and I can't wait for you to check them out. If you choose to purchase or browse any of these items, please go ahead and click the link in my description below. So if you scroll down a little bit and hit that little arrow that points downward next to the title of this video, you will see a bunch of information about these products. And when you click the Erin Condren link, it lets Erin Condren know that you enjoy my content and that you want to see more of their products on my platform. Let's not waste any time and get right into this video. If you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and click that little red button in the bottom right corner, that subscribe button. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy planner content. I have all things planning, productivity on this channel, so make sure you go ahead and subscribe. So I won't waste any time. I'm getting right into this collection. The first thing I'm showing you is the Emoji A5 Kids Diary. This is a really cute customizable diary. It has the ability to customize and put a name or quote here at the bottom. And when you open it up, it is super cute. It has this little dot design going on here. It says my diary. And then you have daily diary pages. These pages are super cute. And I'm going to do a quick little flip through. This diary alternates between pages where kids can put the date, how they feel their day was. They can rate it out of five stars. They can mark their mood and the weather. They can also write a few things in the middle part of this diary. And then they can have a little grateful in tomorrow I want to section. And then there are additional blank pages here too and the colors alternate. So as you flip through, you get a combination of pre boxed pages and then blank pages as well so kids can draw in these blank spaces they can write and honestly this looks like a really cool journaling prompt for an adult if you are new to journaling and you kind of want a guide you could totally track the mood your weather how your day was what you're grateful for and what you want to do tomorrow to work on being intentional so this is something that you could definitely use no matter what age you are and this is the seven by nine next to the a5 for comparison the next planner is the Confetti Kids Ultimate Checklist Notebook. This is also customizable, so you can add a name here. And when you open it, it says Kids Notebook Tracker. I really like this because it starts with a little bit of a biography. Then it goes into routines. And so kids can track their routine each and every day, their morning and evening routine. So I love how this gets them in the habit of creating routines for themselves and of course probably with the help of a parent depending on the age and then you get into the habit section so healthy and helpful habits so that could be you know brushing teeth eating a piece of fruit every day eating a veggie every day um whether it be hygienic routines whether it be reading writing whatever it is that the parent helps the child with this is a pretty cool habit tracker and then it has a chore chart. So this is really nice because I like how it has not only the chores, but also a reward section. And then it says what week you're doing it. We now have the allowance tracker where kids can track what they're saving for and then their allowance as well. Now we have our reading log, which I know is really popular. A lot of kids that I know and my family, they're doing reading logs for the summer especially. So this is right on time for summer. And then there's a note section in the back where kids can write whatever they want in the back of the planner. Next, we have the student planner and I do have a full flip through of the student planner. So if you'd like to check that out, you can go ahead and click the video right there in the cards to check out the full flip through of the academic planner. But just to give you a little bit of a short overview, the academic planner has a monthly spread that looks like this and then it has a weekly spread as well. So monthly spread, then our like dashboard layout and then a weekly spread. So this is the gist of how the academic planner looks. Now, of course, we cannot have planners and notebooks without writing tools. So we have these writing tools here. This is a new set of 24 mini gel pens, and I'm excited. The description says that it's a smooth mini gel pen set featuring 24 assorted colors, neons, pastels, brights, and metallics. So when you open it up, this is how it looks. Super cute. I love how it has all of the colors in order. Um, I mean, they're just cute pens. Let me just pick one up so you can see. 
they are mini this would be the comparison in size so they are quite mini and super cute and i know you want to see how they write so i'm going to go ahead and write a few things here it actually writes really really smoothly All right, now I can't lie, I just wanna sit here and write with these pens all day. They write really nice, super smooth. They are thicker, but I think this is actually perfect for the kids' planners. If your kid is interested in the gel pens, I just think they are perfect. Um, of course, these are great for adults too. I'm an adult, I'm using them, I think they are amazing. I'm just obsessed. I literally want to sit here and play around with them all day. But these are really nice pins. I, I think you got to just try them to see. And so I'll make sure to put that link in the description below so you can get straight to it. But I mean, like, look at this. I don't know if it's coming through across camera as I'm seeing it, but I love these pins. They are really nice. Next, we have the ballpoint pens, and this is a set of six with black ink. And I was told that although they are ballpoint pens, they write like a gel pen. Here are the different colors they come in. Keep in mind that these are all with black ink. I will admit I am not a big ballpoint pen person, but I feel like this pen writes really smooth and it writes really well on the Erin Condren paper. So this is something that I would definitely be interested in using. I will be using these. Um, again, I like that they dry really well because a lot of times with I'm using a gel pen, they, they smear. And so I like the idea of the ballpoint pen as far as smearing is concerned, but I don't like how they write usually. And these write really well. So I think you should give them a shot. Even if you're not a ballpoint pen person, you might like these because it's going to minimize that smearing. And then also, it, I mean, of course it smears a little bit, it's going to minimize that smearing and they really like, I don't know, it's just a nice pen. I'm just gonna be honest. It's just a, it's a nice pen, okay? So I really like them. Um, I will see how I'll use them over time and come back and let you all know, but so far so good. I really like these pens. Next, we have this A5 Snap-In Weekly Dashboard. To read you the description, it says, from outlining priorities to making to-do lists, this colorful, convenient dashboard is just what you need for your busy week. With Monday to Sunday sections on one side, and priorities and to-do list sections on the other, use this productivity tool to reach your daily and weekly goals. So the description of this product is, from outlining priorities to making to-do lists, this colorful and convenient dashboard is just what you need for your busy week. With Monday to Sunday sections on one side and priorities and to-do list sections on the other, use this productivity tool to reach your daily and weekly goals. So this is actually something we have seen before, something similar, but it's A5 size. So you all who have the A5 coiled planners or are interested in them, these are A5 size snap-ins. And so the other si snap-ins have been for seven by nine in the past. These actually fit the A5 and I'm really excited about that. So as you can see, it's snapped in and I know what you're thinking. Okay, we have this snap in. What else? Well, we have wet erase markers and I'm excited about these because I have needed to upgrade mine for quite a while now and I feel like I've been putting it off. These are the old school ones that they used to have in a four pack and they haven't sold these in a little while now. They are throwback for real, but it was time for me to upgrade them because they're starting to dry out. I've just had them for years and years. So now I have these and I'm excited to replace the other ones. I can also use these for my wet erase board. Um, so I'm excited. So what this is, is what wet erase means is that you need something wet to get this off of the dashboard so you'll need to use some type of wet wipe or some type of water to remove it me personally i do like to use a sharpie on these and i use alcohol to remove the sharpie but the wet erase is a great option as well looks like this one was a light a lot brighter and more vibrant than the other colors but overall i do like how they write i like how thin they are because the other ones i had they weren't really a fine tip and so i like that these are fine tip markers now i want to go ahead and see how do they actually wipe so this is supposed to be a wet erase meaning you need something wet to remove it so let's see pass the test it does pass the test I don't really see much coming off as I run my finger across so it's not on the back of my finger either so that's something to keep in mind and yeah I think it dries pretty quickly so that is something to keep in mind for these if you are interested in this again the link will be below and then the back has not only the days of the week but little boxes and i like that they're metallic if you look these are metallic it has a little bit of gold on here so i really like that in the front on the front as well and it's perfect for the a5 size so i'm excited about that 
To add to the A5 collection, we have the A5 Ring Agenda Habit Tracker Dashboard. And I'm excited because I am currently using an A5 Agenda Planner. If you want to check out those videos, go ahead and click the link in the cards. But it has goals and why they're important on the back. And on the front, it has habits and then different habit trackers. And I definitely plan on using this in my A5 setup. And this is how the tracker would look in my A5 planner. So it fits in there perfectly. I cannot wait to use it. Honestly, I'll probably use it as a bookmark more than anything else, but I'm excited about using this and I'm excited about more A5 accessories to come. The next accessory I have is this colorful sticky note ball. It has little sticky notes on each side, so you can just peel them right up off each side and it can sit on your desk like so. And I just love how cute this is. It looks like a little toy or something. It'll be really cute on any teacher's desk and for any student's desk or home office. It's just really cute. And I really enjoy how the pastels look. I mean, I love colorful things, but sometimes I just like when the, the tones are a little bit more pastel and muted. So this is adorable. I love how it looks. And they even threw a lined sticky note in there. So you see it has little lines on it and a grid sticky note. So I really like how they threw those in there, it makes it unique. And this one has the Erin Condren logo on it. So I really like how this turned out. I think it's really cute. Oh, we also have dots here. So I just think they're really cute. And I love how they offered a bunch of different kinds of sticky notes on the sticky note ball. And we can't have back to school without folders, right? So here are the back to school folders. This is pastel mid-century circles, and it's a three pack. So we have this blue light color, this pink color, and then this purplish color. And these are all a three pack in the pastel mid-century circles pack. They call it poly folders again. And so they're not paper. So they don't rip like a paper folder would. And so they seem to be really durable. I would love to use these in my binder. So I'll definitely be adding these to my binder for work. And so I just wanted to show how cute these are. They also come in colorful, just my type. And so these are some really cute quotes. We have plan for the future while honoring the present. Don't forget your vision. And everyone is a work in progress. The quote is on the front. The back has that beautiful ombre. And so I just think they're really cute. And I would definitely grab these for college students, kids, and adults. Next, we have something I'm really excited about. We have three different notepads. Do fit in the back of the A5 agenda. If you'd like to see more of a detailed description of how they fit inside, go ahead and click the video in the cards. I wanted to show you how cool and functional these are. These two are more neutral with blue, and this one is more colorful. And so the three of them have different functions. This one is called the weekly goals notepad. And so it breaks down the most important goals for the week, action steps and to-dos, notes, and then a for next week box. Next, we have the Carpe Diem. This is called the weekly projects and exam. And this could work for any student, including college students. So I love this. We also have this one called Focus Daily. And so it has daily boxes. Next, we have a projects and exams tracker. The description says, from tracking class projects and exams to logging important notes and deadlines, this two-sided reusable dashboard is a great way to stay on track and make the grade. With a dedicated project tracker on one side and an exam tracker on the other, use this color-coded wet and dry erase tool to make this school year your best one. So I really like this. And what's cool about this one is that, like I said, it has that metallic front and back. And I love how it has a section for upcoming exams as well as long-term projects. And so if I was going to fill this out, just to give you a little example, it's kind of cool to teach students early how to go ahead and map out their projects and exams. And the same thing, like I said, on the back. So there is room for seven projects and exams in additional and then additional space for long-term projects or upcoming projects. So I really like this. I think it's really cute. I think it'd be perfect for, if I was in school, I would totally be down with this. And honestly, I have a lot of projects for work. So I might put my projects on here and then just like hang it up on my wall instead of putting it in my planner just to keep it in front of me. But I like this little snap in. I think it could definitely work for a student. Next, I have this super cool stand-up pencil case. In this case, I just want to note that it also comes in the mid-century circles design. I'll be honest, I really want that design. So I just wanna go ahead and show you what that looks like. I have my markers here and I'm just going to demonstrate how it works. So you put your pens in here for on the go, you close it up. Let's say you have a student in your home and you get this for your student or your child and you open it up 
And when they get to school, they can pull these little tabs here down. And when they pull the tabs down, it turns into a pencil case. How cute is this? So it turns into a, a standing pencil case on its own. The more pens and pencils you have in, the better. And I even put my little scissors in here so these could sit on your student's desk. And so when you sit them there, it's perfect because when they're ready to go and put this in their backpack, they can just pull this tab up, close it, and then they have all their supplies. And to add to this super cute pencil pouch, we have glue sticks. Can't send the younger kids to school without glue sticks. How cute are these? You won't get them mixed up because everyone will know, you know, these are mine. <laughs> They won't get mixed up with anyone else's. They will know these are their glue sticks. And so you can put those in here as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these in. So I got my glue sticks chilling at the bottom. There's still actually a lot of space to put more pens and things like that in here. But then I'd open it while I'm at school pull it down and boom I have my little pencil cup right there on my desk with me so I love how this stand-up pencil case fits so many accessories inside and I think it would be perfect for school I wish I had one of these when I was in school because it would be perfect and the other design is pink on the bottom with mid-century circle up top so you got to check that out next we have these super cute weekly schedule dashboards and I love these because they're magnetic serves as a bookmark so when you open up the page you know it all keeps all those pages together. And so I'm just gonna make a little to-do list here for a little example. And so it's perfect. I mean, I feel like it writes really well on these and you have a front and a back, which is pretty cool. And so this has the same exact thing on the front and the back. This one is called the Productivity Magnetic Dashboard. This one is the Habit Tracker Magnetic Dashboard. And this one is the Weekly Schedule Magnetic Dashboard. So these are really cool. I love how they just, you know, they're magnets. You could probably put this really comfortably on any planner because they're magnetic. So I really like that. And as you can see, I'm going to go ahead and wipe off the wet erase. I just did a quick little wipe off of that last item with water and you can barely tell that it was there. So just a little water gets that right off. Last but not least, we have the Color Blends Desk Organizer Set. And this is the first item. So the Color Blends Desk Organizer Set has four items in it. So this is the first item. And of course you can put file folders, different storage inside of here. This pencil cup is the next piece. I love this ombre pretty color that it has going on here. It's like a deep purple at the bottom and then goes like into blue and pink. It's really pretty. So that's the next section. And you can see it sections off the different pens and I have my scissors in here as well. So it has a lot of space for pens in there and scissors or whatever other kind of supplies you may wanna put inside. Next we have this organizer and you can put lots of things in here too. So when I was in the classroom, I just remember I used to have all kinds of things. I used to have remote controls, different office supplies, post-it notes, all kinds of things. And so I think this is perfect to fit inside all of your little knickknacks and things that you usually have on your desk. If you have any other accessories, you can also put your magnetic accessories on here. So they work. So I just put that right there to kind of hold it. A lot of different ideas. I know I tend to put my wireless mouse for when I'm not using my computer. I'll put that inside of here. The possibilities are endless with this one. And finally, you have this cute tray, which I tend to put paper inside. So it's pink on that side and then it goes to a gradual blue. So I tend to put paper in here, like printer paper, or you can put any type of papers that you need to file or grade inside of here as well if you're a teacher. So I like to put different papers in here and it just works for me for that purpose. But you could also use it as a hub for your planner. So if I want to take my A5 planner, I could totally put my A5 planner in there too and it fits perfectly and you can even fit a bigger planner in here. So I love how that just sits in there and so that's also another function. Thank you so much for watching my video. Those are all the items from this collection. I was so happy to be able to show them to you and they will be available on this date. So make sure you go ahead and check that out when they are available. And there will be more products coming in August. So this is not it. There will be more products launching at the end of the summer. So make sure you stay tuned and subscribe to my channel so that when they're available, you'll be the first one to know. Make sure you go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed my review. And if you have any questions about any of the items, feel free to ask me in the comments below. I'll do my best to get to them. And then go ahead and follow me on Instagram at Chloe Tree Plans, where I will have more pictures of these items as well. Thank you so much for tuning in and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.